According to the World Health Organization, the dangerous and sometimes deadly hepatitis C virus infects 170 million people, more than 3 million of those here in the U.S. Now, there is no vaccine available for hep C, and treatment success varies. But new tonight on Austin News, Jim Swift tells us about a Williamson County man who is finding relief from the effects of the disease in a most unlikely way. What you gonna do, Waffle? His name is Miles Allen. Come on. And he's got plenty on, of boy. miles under his belt. Here we go. Hepatitis C is uh, supposedly there's no cure for it. Uh, I received mine in a blood transfusion back there in the Vietnam area. And I had to take some interferon treatments. I had to make myself sick for a year. I didn't bring my swimming suit. But Snake's always got hers on. I went 200 pounds to 140. And I had forgotten how to get up, forgotten how to walk. And a friend of mine brought me a board of collie. Things immediately began to change. It just gives you something to take care of. You've got something that bonds with you. They're not going to just let you sit there and waste away. At some point, after the dog arrived, something else showed up. And it turned into a real good combination. There you go. You just want to work this one? <laughs> hey, hey, hey there, boys. Look at there. We got a puppy who wants to work. The reason for these sheep was to work this dog. Good. Before long, Alan was breeding border collars. Got to hold that mutton. And the more dogs he had, the more sheep he wanted. <laughs> I got to feeding the sheep and taking care of them and watching the horns grow. Now, Alan is known all over the territory as a breeder and trader of both species. I don't claim to be a dog trainer by any means. I think it, uh, over the years, he just learned to handle these border collies. That's good. They're bred to work. Border collies are known for high energy levels and a need to keep moving. But over the years, Alan learned something about them. You don't have to have a ranch, you don't have to have sheep. All you have to have is time to spend with your dog. I guess my goal in life is to see that everybody in Texas gets a good border collie. Not a bad goal for a man who once found it to be all he could do to just stay alive. My last blood test is clear. I, and I really look for all the rest of them to be clear. And these border collies had a lot to do with it. In Williamson County. Let's go, Waffle. Jim Swift, KXAF, Austin News. Job well done. smart dogs. Mm -hmm. You can get a closer look at Miles Allen and his animals as well as information about causes and symptoms of hepatitis C and available treatments on the internet. Just follow the links we've set up for you at KXAN.com.